Hi, I'm Andrew with the CPAP shop, and I'm here today to talk about BiPAP, what it is, why it's important, and who should use it. BiPAP stands for bi-level positive airway pressure, and it's used to treat severe cases of obstructive sleep apnea, and in some instances, central sleep apnea. But before we talk about BiPAP, let's first talk about CPAP. Traditional CPAP therapy, or continuous positive airway pressure, provides patients with a singular air pressure throughout the night. This pressure, measured anywhere from four to 20, is the minimum amount of air pressure needed to keep the user's airway open. Another version of CPAP therapy is APAP, or automatic positive airway pressure. While this version still only provides one singular air pressure throughout the night, that number can change depending on the user's needs. For example, if you roll into a sleeping position that creates a greater obstruction on your airway, the air pressure from the machine will increase to accommodate the change. Unfortunately, some individuals may not succeed with CPAP or APAP therapy. They may feel that they are unable to catch their breath during therapy and may still wake up feeling lethargic and restless. For those users, they may be prescribed BiPAP. Most BiPAP machines deliver air pressure between 4 and 25 and do so using two pressure settings. Hence, bi-level. Inspiratory positive airway pressure, or IPAP, is the air pressure delivered as the user inhales. Expiratory positive airway pressure, EPAP, is only delivered as the user exhales and is always lower than the IPAP pressure. These two pressures work together to provide a more comfortable form of therapy for individuals with more severe cases of OSA. But BiPAP has other uses as well. Central sleep apnea, or CSA, is a sleep disorder where the brain does not give the signal to breathe to the lungs. Some BiPAP machines include a spontaneously timed breathing algorithm. So, if a user has a central apnea event and stops breathing, the BiPAP will trigger a mechanical breath, similar to a ventilator. These mechanical breaths will continue until the user begins to breathe on their own again. BiPAP machines require a special prescription from your doctor. They're used to treat specific conditions, so don't think of them as a fancy CPAP. If you think you may require BiPAP therapy, talk to your doctor. In our next video, we'll show you some of our most popular BiPAP machines. If you found the information in this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for additional videos. I'm Andrew from the CPAP Shop, and as always, thanks for watching.